president also said he opposes defunding police departments. That's something Pittsburgh Mayor Bill Peduto is now weighing in on, along with a push to recruit more officers. Our Jennifer Barrasso has new reaction tonight from the mayor. Jennifer. Oh. Okay, Mayor Peduto had a lot to say. He told KDK a lot of work still needs to be done. He said recruitment numbers are down. He said he is not in favor of defunding the police. I haven't spoken with one mayor in the country who has said that it's a good idea right now to put less into law enforcement. Pittsburgh Mayor Bill Peduto told KDKA police reform is needed, but defunding the police is not a good idea. Defunding the police was one of 12 demands the group, the Black Activist and Organizer Collective, hand delivered to the city Monday afternoon. I will respond to the, the whole issue uh, within those seven days in the manner that they had requested. Mayor Peduto announced his support for the Eight Can't Wait campaign earlier this month. It is aimed at decreasing police brutality through eight different reform policies. It's very interesting. I spent three hours in Homewood this Saturday. Not one person was talking about defunding or abolishing the police. What they were saying is we have to reevaluate how we're recruiting police officers. We have to reevaluate how they're being trained and change that training. And the mayor says recruitment is an issue. We still see recruitment numbers that are not sufficient to what our goals are. Mayor Peduto says he's working with churches, historic black colleges, and those leaving the military to find qualified, diverse people. He wants to recruit young people from local neighborhoods. So we started a technical education program in Homewood at Westinghouse High School where we're training our high school students for careers as firefighters, medics, and police officers. If you really want to get somebody who cares about the community, have somebody who grew up in the community as a Pittsburgh police officer. And the mayor said he wants to take that program, spread it to all Pittsburgh public schools, and create internship opportunities at one of the local universities. So by the time a high school graduate turns 20, he or she can get a full-time job working in Pittsburgh public safety. Reporting live, Jennifer Barrasso, KDK News.